Hello guys, welcome to this video and today I'm going to tell you about how you can move photo or video from your PC or laptop to your iPhone without an iTunes. So basically this technique can be done using iTunes, but if you're using iTunes, you will get trouble when you want to delete that photo or video in your camera roll. So. With this technique, you can move your photo or video to iPhone and that file can be deleted later. This technique is about to show you using a software called ShareIt. You can download the software for free in the official website or read the description for the link below. Okay, first of all, you have to download and install the application like usually. Once you've done it, you can open share it. It automatically will create a network so our iPhone can join that network to share some files to each other. The network of course protected by password so some other people cannot join that network. We can see the password that share it create with click in the blue box here and checklist the show character option and that's it for the pc and let's go jump to the iphone now we are in the iphone so let's open the app store to download and install share it but of course i have already installed it once share it has been installed then we open that app you will see the main interface share it for the iphone and before we can sharing some files, we actually have to connect our iPhone to the network that ShareIt creates in our PC or laptop earlier. Because I already have connected to that network before, so it will connect automatically when I turn the Wi-Fi on. If you have covered by some network, so you have to connect with some weird name like this and try the password. Once you are connected, open again the Share It app and go to Web Share. There's IP in there, so we can open from our laptop using web browser. But make sure you stay in the Web Share page when you are uploading from the web browser, because if you close the Web Share, the connection from our web browser in laptop will lose. When we open the IP written in there, the inter the interface should be like this or so. Let's see in my files, photo, and there's nothing in here. So let's go back to the web share so we can upload some video to it. Okay, let me refresh the web browser. And now we go to photo and upload a video once it's done we can take a look in my files photo and there we have and now we can save this video to camera roll and post to instagram maybe and when you have done it with the video you can easily delete that video all right guys that's it for now thanks for watching like this video if you like and don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.